Hey guys, this video blog comes all the way from Da Nang, Vietnam. Da Nang is in central Vietnam, has a population of about 900,000, and my wife Audra and I are here visiting my brother and his family. They lived here for about two years now. Aside from spending as much time with them as possible, we've also had the opportunity to hang out with a couple of nonprofit organizations here in Da Nang, which has been very cool because part of the MBA program, my concentration is nonprofit management. So it's been very insightful just to see how they operate on a day-to-day -day basis, see how they make decisions. And because there are so many restrictions and regulations here in Vietnam, it's been interesting to see how they overcome uh, those obstacles. But today, mainly what I want to talk about is writing at a graduate school level. Regardless of the class that you take, there will be a significant amount of writing required, whether it's case studies, whether it's writing from uh, readings in the text, or just personal papers, you can expect a fair amount of writing. I just completed my leadership class and one of the last things we had to write in that class was a personal reflections paper. For me that was uh, a really neat experience because it made me really sit down and think where I'm at, what I want to achieve, and what I hope, uh, where I hope to be in the next three years, five years, and so forth. One of the things that all professors want from you during your writing is they want it to be succinct but they want it to be very thorough all the bases. Uh, depending on the professor, you may have different variations in the style, but definitely, definitely what they want you to do is to cover uh, the full basis and the reading material. So this is me in Vietnam. Hopefully I can post another blog from here pretty soon, but thanks for watching and I'll talk to you soon.